All right, truly two different versions of Do It Together, <laughs> but both great. All right, uh, get ready for your qu questions, people. Uh, first, Ruth, uh, the Global Music Network. Yes. Quite a name. Yeah. yeah. Um, hey. <laughs> how do you make a global network like that just keep together? Well, we've just started it, so ask me maybe in a year. But no, we've got these networks that we already work with. So for me, it's about kind of a democratic process, bringing people together, getting everybody's ideas, and representing what people really need. So the three ambitions that I talked about before are things that have come from those networks already. And it's about then everybody pitching in and providing the tools so one network's going to build a website, one network's going to do something else, so that we can kind of make all of these things happen. Yeah. All right. Ariel, I have to ask you about the asteroid lamp. <laughs> Is it really working? Uh, not currently, but it was. Uh, that was uh, the asteroid lamp was something that I uh, I threw the idea out for during the first science hack day in San Francisco, and uh, I was just like, wouldn't it be cool to have like a light like go off every time an asteroid goes by the Earth. Um, and I was running the, the Science Hack Day event, so I didn't have much time to hack on it myself, but I got together like all the materials, and I actually have, a, I have an open source rocket scientist friend, uh, as everyone should. Um, <laughs> and he hacked on it together uh, with me, and, and we were able to get it working, although um, you couldn't see very well in the image, but some of the lamp was actually made out of plastic cups, so it was very hacky. <laughs> I'm not sure if I understood right, but so I'm going to ask you, uh, has spacehack.org uh, discovered stuff in space that like the regular space institutions hasn't? Or Well, so spacehack.org tries to sort of catalog all the different projects and activities that are going around, but uh, projects like Galaxy Zoo have very much uh, found galaxies, they have other projects that have found planets, and, and yeah, things that otherwise uh, regular institutions have not, um, okay. which is really exciting. Mm -hmm. um, Planet Hunters is another one of their projects, uh, planethunters.org, and that's something where you can go and discover new exoplanets uh, through NASA's Kepler data. And, and this is stuff that would otherwise get overlooked by NASA, so it's kind of cool. If you need a new hobby or a new title, mm -hmm. Planet Hunter seems like <laughs> a good one, I think. All right, questions? Questions? <laughs> We've blown You're really our minds. tired? <laughs> <laughs> All right, I have one more for, um, uh, for uh, Ariel, the last one. Uh, when I saw that uh, picture with the dog, uh, can you really do things? Maybe you, both of you can answer this one. Can you really do things together without actually knowing what you're doing? Uh, in my case, yes, because I don't really, I don't have a degree in science, <laughs> and I'm learning things as I'm going, and, and I think the whole purpose of Science Hack Day is to show that you can play around with things without really understanding how they work or, or knowing a lot about them, and it's kind of breaking down the perceived barrier that you have to know a lot about science in order to do anything with it, so um, absolutely, it's, it's, it's just about playing with things and figuring it out as you go along, and and as that video showed, uh, even all the NASA scientists didn't really know what they were doing either. So, uh, so yeah, absolutely. So w without having a goal, you might be able to reach the stars anyway. Yeah. <laughs> For me, that's like the total opposite of what I pr pretty much learned about networks, that you should have a goal and you should work together. But maybe <laughs> that's, that's not the way. All right. Um, I think you guys are tired. <laughs> Uh, which is a pity because now the party starts. <laughs> and to really kick that off, because you know after this there is like uh, Malik Benjilul speaking the Oscar winner, you know, Searching for Sugarman, probably one of the greatest movies ever. Um, we we'll also have a science slam, there will be a dock lounge going on and some on conference. Uh, and I didn't want it to end like this because I had a feeling that you guys are going to be so tired. So we have to end with a boom. And then this I is, thought this is that. Really bad for me. What's about to happen is bad for me. Yeah. And I just talked with uh, Ruth yesterday uh, and I talked to Ariel today about this. And Ruth is on. Um, Ariel thinks a dress is not appropriate for doing this thing. Uh, but I want you to all go together here in one big row. Come on, everybody.
I'm trusting all of you to, to do yeah, this. Yeah, I'm not gonna tell. We're not gonna tell them yet. Okay. Everybody, just sticking in like one tight line here, from the stage to the door. One tight line. <laughs> and don't walk out. <laughs> keep standing here, because Ruth, you've been a band in a band for a long time, uh, and you've been working with music the whole your, your whole life, but you've never stage dive, right? No. No. So we're gonna give her this as a present from Malmo. She's gonna be able to do her first stage dive ever. So get together close. And then you kind of, she's gonna jump, you need to get closer here to the stage. So strong people. And then you should just like carry her out of the door, through the door. Yeah, you're gonna do, go back, backwards, but just wait a little bit more. And I think the rest of you should just like be shouting and <laughs> kicking this evening session off. All right? Are you guys ready? Right. A little they bit look, closer. They look very ready. I, well, I don't. I've never done it. <laughs> okay. For Manchester, Ruth, go! Whoa. <laughs> Come on, let's do it. Oh, Carrier no. over. Carrier. <laughs> From Mama to Ruth. Oh From Mama to Manchester, all the way outside. Oh my God. Woo! <laughs> Come on, oh. all the way. Choo How are you feeling, Ruth? Doing okay? I, I think she's losing All right, applause, yeah. All the way out. <laughs> Woo! Okay, now the evening starts. Go party, people. Choo -hoo! Thank you for today.